Unlocking the Twisted Secrets of a Bay of Blood In the annals of horror cinema, there exists a film that stands as a testament to both the creative brilliance and controversy-inducing power of the genre. A Bay of Blood, also known as Twitch of the Death Nerve, is a chilling masterpiece that defies conventions and leaves an indelible mark on all who dare to witness its twisted tale. At its core, A Bay of Blood is a descent into madness, a journey into the darkest recesses of human greed and desperation. Conceived amidst a backdrop of creative clashes and production challenges, this film emerged as a groundbreaking exploration of parental paranoia, visceral violence, and the consequences of unchecked ambition. As we delve into the depths of this cinematic gem, we uncover 10 key aspects that define its legacy and continue to captivate audiences decades after its release. From its tumultuous production history to its enduring influence on the horror genre, A Bay of Blood remains a haunting enigma that demands exploration and analysis. Join us as we unravel the mysteries, dissect the gore, and uncover the hidden truths of A Bay of Blood. Prepare yourself for a journey into the heart of darkness, where no one is safe and nothing is as it seems. Welcome to the world of Mario Bava's macabre masterpiece, a world where terror reigns supreme and the bay runs red with blood. 10 Things You Need to Know About A Bay of Blood 1. The Genesis of Gore A Bay of Blood, also known as Twitch of the Death Nerve, is not your average thriller. Its inception involved a tumultuous collaboration between producer Dino De Laurentiis and director Mario Bava, stemming from a fallout between screenwriter Dardano Sacchetti and director Dario Argento. What emerged was a twisted tale of parental greed, murder, and betrayal. 2. Parental Paranoia A Bay of Blood explores the lengths parents will go to secure a better future for their children. Sacchetti and Bava crafted a narrative where parental desperation leads to a series of gruesome murders, culminating in a shocking twist involving the children themselves. 3. A production in peril, the film faced numerous challenges during production, from budget constraints to creative clashes. Bava, in dire need of a hit to settle his back taxes, turned to Giuseppe Zaccariello for production support, leading to a tumultuous journey filled with script revisions and casting challenges. 4. Title Troubles Like many films of its genre, A Bay of Blood underwent multiple title changes before and after release. From Antifado to Ecologia del Delito to Riesione Catina, the film's titles reflected its evolving identity and attempts to capture audience attention. 5. DIY filmmaking at spite its low budget, Bava's ingenuity shone through in every frame. Acting as his own cinematographer, he employed creative solutions, including using a child's wagon for tracking shots and crafting makeshift forests from forest branches to create an immersive experience for viewers. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and join the crew by subbing and clicking the bell. 6. For Galore, Alo Rambaldi's special effects added a visceral layer to the film's violence. From wax effigies to meticulously crafted death scenes, every murder was brought to life with gruesome realism, leaving audiences both shocked and enthralled. 7. Controversial reception, A Bay of Blood, sparked heated debates among critics and audiences alike. While some hailed its visual flair and unabashed violence, Others criticized its gratuitous gore and convoluted plot, leading to a polarized reception that continues to divide audiences to this day. 8. Influence and Legacy Despite its initial reception, A Bay of Blood left an indelible mark on the horror genre. Its innovative murder sequences and narrative twists laid the groundwork for future slasher films, inspiring directors like Wes Craven and influencing classics such as Friday the 13th Part 2. 9. Critical reflection over the years, critical opinions on A Bay of Blood have evolved. While some still dismiss it as a mere exercise in shock value, others recognize its significance as a trailblazer in horror cinema, with its impact continuing to resonate in contemporary films. 10. 
A horror essential, whether you're a die-hard horror fan or a casual viewer, A Bay of Blood remains a must-watch for its historical importance and enduring influence. With its mix of suspense, gore, and unexpected twists, it's a testament to Mario Bava's visionary storytelling and his lasting legacy in the world of horror cinema. Who's your daddy?